Lord, take perfect control and give complete victory over our lives. For we are redeemed with the precious blood of Jesus. We are called unto you to be holy unto you, O Lord. We are called to live right. We are called to walk in obedience. We are called to let our light shine before men. That they will see your good works and glorify the Father who is in heaven. We are called, O Lord God, to help one another. We are called to do the best that we can. We are not called, O Lord, to be wicked and weak and abominable and all kinds of things that contrary against you. We are called, O Lord, to walk in the light as Christ as the light and to have fellowship one with another. We are called, O Lord, to worship you best of all and to worship you in spirit and in truth. Oh yes, Lord, we have a high calling. We are royal priesthood. We are chosen generation. We are called out to walk in the body of Christ. We are the church. Who Jesus said, upon this rock, I'll build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail. We are not called to tremble before the enemies and to bow down to demons and to worship Satan and do the wickedness of the wicked. No, we are called, O oh Lord, unto you to do righteousness. To walk in righteousness. To walk, Lord God, the right path. So let your will be done. Cover us now. Cover us, Lord, with your precious blood. And let us go forward in our true calling. For we are your people, the sheep of your pastor. And we are not going to walk contrary to your will. For you have the power to do anything on our behalf. Father, I want to say thank you for being the example, showing us that we can be obedient. As long as we have a relationship with God, we can be obedient without the but. I will do it, Lord, but, mm. or I trust you, but stop butting God out of our situations. Yes. Fast, I got out from you. Fully submit to him. Fully obey him. Father God, I lift up this platform to you tonight. Mm -hmm. Holiness, health, and prosperity ministries. Giving you thanks as you continue to teach each and every one of us to be obedient as you live for you. No matter how hard the task, no matter how far fetched it may be, give us the strength to be obedient. Yes, Lord. Your word says, Thy word is a lamp unto thy feet and a light unto our path. Your word is our roadmap to obedience. Yes, Lord. So I ask that you give us that desire the hunger and thirst after righteousness. Mm -hmm. Give us the strength to carry along on this journey, just like Abraham, Hannah, and yourself, Jesus. Help us along this life journey because we know that if we remain obedient, we will reap blessings. We will reap the good of the land. So yes. once again, Father God, tonight I say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. <music> Oh, and that, 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 that lady, she can, she can make a plan. She needs to come to get the help of that girl. Mm -hmm. Are we willing to that? Oh, God, as a, oh, as a church, as a member of God, family, that we can trust that. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Hey, shut up, Lord. Hey. Oh, God. You know, sometimes we think everybody against us. Mm -hmm. But only us that the word of God stands with us. But God, the Bible says, and look at our Roman AAT, for the disappointments of the price of God cannot become bigger the glory with the glory of the other. So, saints of us, we have the church. Hallelujah. Ready to say, be obedient. Your help me with my obedience to my proclamation. I don't know who else to say that. Help me, Lord God, to do the work to be good to people. Mm -hmm. To do what the Bible says. It's funny what the Sharia says. But it's all this. And we give you all the honor, Lord, for We say we love you, Jesus. Oh, we love you, Jesus. We don't love you, just from up top. 
We love you from the heart. Oh. Yes, Lord. 